Let's now take a look at the push-pull pattern. This is a pattern where the data flows downstream. Uh, the push sockets have no ability to receive messages. This is also known as a producer-consumer pattern where the consumer can only send messages downstream. Now, the other thing to keep in mind is that the messages are fair queued. That, let's say you have a push socket with three messages to send to three sockets. Each socket will receive one message. Okay, that message M1 will not get duplicated. Only one pull socket will receive M1, only one socket will receive M2, and only one socket, pull socket, will receive M3. Let's see what that diagram looks like in practice. We'll have two Visual Studio projects and We'll have three pull sockets running in separate threads and one push socket that'll be sending messages. And as you can see, the iteration numbers are unique. None of them are duplicated. And the messages are being distributed fairly. 